Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another video. Um, oops. Okay, the sensitivity is a little high. So is the movement. Holy crap. I can really move. I can also zoom in. So this game was made by the same creator of a uh, concrete simulator. And this game is called Endic. CAD? I don't know what that means, but this was suggested to me by a viewer. This music is lovely, but uh, look at this. It's interesting. You move fast as hell, though. We got the milk. I don't really know what to say. It's already creepy, and they got the really cool music, which I might turn down just a bit. Alright. We got some flowers in the windowsill. I really love his art style. We got a series of rooms here. And a weird basement area. I want to save that for later. So, Cement Mixer Simulator was a very trippy game, but I loved it. Loved the whole art style. A little. I loved everything about it. But this, I don't know anything about. Oh, well, this is nice. Somebody was just sitting here. Fixing this while they were... Chilling out and drinking whatever this is. Some kind of coffee. That looks like milk. Or creamer. With coffee. And then that looks like... in. Alcoholic drink of some sort. But look at that, the flowers growing out of there. And what's really trippy about this is that everything out here is just wood. What is this? Do they all have basements? Maybe we should look at that basement. The first house we've looked at. Oops, I don't even remember where the first house was. Was it this one? So I love games like this, and I'm glad somebody suggested this to me. It was in the first, uh, well, it was in the, uh, cement mixer simulator. But I guess we'll go down here. Maybe they all connect. This, this was just all underground, huh? Huh. Oh! Hey, you look kind of familiar. You almost look like a smaller version of those other things I saw that scared me so much, but you, you're busy. You're working. This is pretty. Don't know what you're working on. There's something in there. One of them's in there. There's, there's quite a few in this one. I don't think I can go in here though. Oh no, I can. Can I just jump on top of all of them? Hello. Am I interrupting y'all? This one ain't even doing nothing. This poor guy. He doesn't even want to be here, really. I'm pressing random buttons just to see if anything does anything. The camera here. these people are working but some of them well, the one doesn't want to you see who that's actually kind of cool I think like more is out the bigger that they are it seems like the older they are the more experience they have with whatever they're doing here and this person he don't care he just wants to be done with this it's kind of sad actually this says a lot about society just walking on top of all of them though. Wait, was there another one that was empty? Yeah, there was. Hmm. And you. You're just. I bet you're like peeking in on them. You're the one who. Oh no, you guys are like trying to escape or something. Or you're trying to like not work. You guys took the camera out. 
you're like looking in on them. Seems like these poor little guys are being forced to work here. It's kind of sad. Look at that. Here's the people watching the cameras. What a curiosity. Is that... Camera's still going? The one in here? Okay, no. For some reason I thought it was, and it was just pointed at a trash can, but... Yeah, that's... Look at this place. Hello. You just dropped dead, didn't you? Oh, goody, goody, goody. I like how this room looks. I play games with just a series of rooms quite often, don't I? Ooh, this... I like this. This kind of reminds me of something from uh, Yumi Nikki. Or LSD Dream Emulator. I'd love to play LSD Dream Emulator. That's an unsettling sound. It's probably a little quiet for you guys, sorry. Sounds like... Look at those wood frogs. Here, I'll turn it up. Hopefully this isn't too loud or quiet, sorry. It sounds like one of those wooden frogs that mimic the sound of frogs. I've always wanted one of those. I think they're so cool. I really like this though. Something about just being out in the middle of water with just walkways like this is just so peaceful to me. And the sky is so beautiful. I could have played this in my web browser too, so if you just have a computer, you could probably just play this on itch.io. Looks like we might be heading towards whatever those are. There's like some ASMR in the background. These ones look like they're almost grown. Can I have them? Somebody suggested this to me and I'm really happy about it. People always talk about getting like a tingle sensation from ASMR. And uh... I just never understood that. I don't think this is ASMR, but it is kind of like little random sound effect effects that I imagine just tickle somebody's brain. These are like weird radio towers. I like how nothing really makes too much sense in a lot of these games. Ooh, I want to check this out. But at the same time, you can kind of put things together if you look hard enough, and I like that. That's that's what art is to me. Ooh, you're kind of messed up, aren't you, little feller? You got whatever these are. Very nice. He's just sitting in the kitchen, just like, hungry, but at the same time, he just, he's thinking about his entire life. I'm getting an ASMR tingle from this. person believes in some sort of religion. 
This person believes in a lot of religion. What about those meaty textures, though? Just weird meaty. They're corrupted. Hello. Just a spider. Can I get on top of you? I feel like I'm not supposed to. This is some weird water creature. The spider narwhal. They live in the lands of uh, Czechoslovakia. The waters of Czechoslovakia. Kind of a cool beat though. This is like a boat. This is a cool s boat. Has there ever even been a boat like this before? With that type of style? This is really neat. Look at this. I feel slightly panicked when it starts to speed up. Like, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I just... I'm scared. Not really, but... This looks important. Oh, I can get on here. Like, I feel like I should be running when it speeds up. It's really chill until it starts speeding up. But this does sound like music that I could fall asleep to. I want to get to it. You know what's really funny about that little sound? I was just hearing that on my computer. How come I can't get to that flower? Okay. Love how it looks. I want to see what this is, though. I don't think there is. Wish there was a screenshot button. This one. Like a weird Christmas tree. You know what? I could probably sleep in a place like this. Honestly. We get so, like, connected to, like, media and stuff, and we're just, like, so overwhelmed. Some of us actually need sound to fall asleep. I do. But I feel like in a place like this, it'd just be so peaceful. I wouldn't even want that. I need sound to fall asleep sometimes. But I'm trying to get over that. Anybody else do that? I think that's just a common thing with people nowadays, you know? Sometimes I don't even watch the video. Sometimes I roll around and just listen to it. Can't be the only. Okay, I'm crazy. Oh, here we got one up close. Oh, never mind. Huh? 
Huh. Oh, we jump up really high in this one. Alright, I got a few questions on what this is. It kind of seems like whatever this thing is drags this around. And is taking this liquid, I'm assuming is water, and putting it into this. That's just a theory. Oh, look at the Hell Valley Sky Trees. These look like, uh, Berserker symbols. This one's got two of them. Some weird creature. Perhaps I'm one of these. I'd love to see like just some toxic Call of Duty like gamer just go on to here, and play this game and be like, "What the fuck? What's going on?" They just really don't understand, and they're just trying to run through everything. Look, I gotta get to that. Hello. Oh, cool! I was actually supposed to do that. Now we're in this really interesting area. I kind of want to go down there, but what is this? Ooh, this is kind of cool. I like this. We're inside of the walls. That looks like a bigger version of what we saw. This is like a nest of these weird creatures. This is really cool, though. I thought this would teleport me, but what's down here? Nothing. I really like that that was just out of bounds. Something I really like about this guy's games. I've only played one of them before, but... Oh, here's a bridge. Wow, this is pretty. thing is kind of cute whatever it is it's like a woolly mammoth it's got a little family inside it's kind of cute is this a puzzle I can put together yeah okay. oh these are like different okay you guys remember the last game with all the doors? This is kind of like that. Isn't it? I imagine all of these are like... Yeah. This is going to lead me to the same area. Wait, no it's not. We're in a snowy area which really matches the theme of winter. This is cool. I bet we'll find all kinds of secrets here. I expect to jump up really high every time I jump now. This is so cool. Something about this is really... Aesthetically pleasing to my eyes. It's kind of creepy. Oh, we got some weird stuff happening. Oh, uh, we're in the creepy area now. That other place looked like it had blood, but now it looks like whatever that blood is is just turning to this weird gas. This is really, really cool looking, though. Like, just this right here, this is literally... I would have this hung up in my wall. That is art. That is art.
Hmm. So many things going on, I can't really explain what I'm looking at. But I really love that there's color when you look through this and these things, but not anything else. Isn't that just the coolest? Did I touch that? No. It's like a gas spill or something. This is like the ends of the world. Hello, what the fuck are you? Sorry. I didn't mean to upset you. It's creepy. I don't like being out here. Sorry. Hello. Aloha. What are you, man? You look like you got a weird, like, elephant face, and then whatever's going on there is weird, and... Cool, though. <laughs> you know what? I feel like these games are related to each other somehow. Look at this thing that he's writing. Doesn't that... Wait, maybe the... Oh my gosh, do you guys remember the last game? Maybe the gremlin people are the ones who took care of those animals with the faces. You all remember that? Maybe these little gremlin people took care of the animals with the faces. Maybe that's what I was in the last game I played. Think about it. It all makes sense now. The goblin people. It's all connected. And is he carrying those little plants? I think he is. I really want to see more of that. Because I absolutely loved that last game. What's in here, though? Ooh, thank you. The cake. Oh, I love that cake. That cake looks delicious. Everything else looks pretty simple. This looks pretty good. This and then that cake, That's that's looks good. I love just chocolate cake that doesn't have a whole bunch of frosting, but it has some. Like, I hate frosting. I hate it. I like ice cream cake with a little bit of ice cream, but you can't stand cake with frosting. This is very detailed here. Wow, that is so cool. Something is getting louder, it seems like. Hello. That, that is so cool. Gold? Oh, we're back here. So oh, lovely. I'm just going to be looking through every little crack to see if there's a way I can go. And then I'm going to get lost. Stuck. Look at all these chairs. Feels like this is another HUD area for... It. Th this is really nice, though. It does kind of give me a... LS not LSD. It reminds me of... Uh, yeah, actually, kind of LSD Dream Emulator or Yumi Niki. Reminds me of Yumi Niki. Where everything is kind of connected. Sing with me. I can't jump off. Look at that, it's Heaven's Gates. But that water is a bit chilly. Look at that little guy. It's kind of cute. These things are kind of cute. 
That one looks kind of messed up because of his eyes, but he's still kind of cute. This guy, he's alright. I bet he's mean, though. Like, I bet he's really, like, just not a good little monkey. I thought I saw a door, but I'm crazy. I don't think it was this, though. Dang it, somebody broke the bridge. It was probably that monkey. Little tight spaces. Here we are. Hello. You gonna take me back to... Yes, you are. Okay. I think we've explored this whole area here. I'm gonna head back. Okay, it's not letting me go back. I like these areas, though. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to, like, look at this entire game. I might miss something, and I'm sorry if I do. This game... Feels much, much bigger than the last. Hello, religious people. Where is your god now? Walking on radio. Oh. Hello. Oh, you had too much brain. I'm sorry to hear that. What's this little area here? Is there a way to crouch that I just don't know about? I don't believe so. Sounds that you can that help you poop. Dot MP3. <laughs> Nothing. I'm sorry. That was that's not an insult to the game. It's just that little sound effect in the background reminds me of that one. I wanna go. I wanna go. What if you had a dog play this game? Like, what? What would they do? Or like, what if you? taught like a chimpanzee to play video games which I'm sure some of them know how but, like what if you taught a chimpanzee to play this game like what would they think would they be scared would they understand what's happening would they try to look for a deeper meaning perhaps or would they try to just get it over with to earn their chimpanzee prize, which is, uh, I don't know, some kind of ice cream, because that's what chimpanzees eat. Like, what is they gonna do? 
Are they gonna understand? If you try to teach them art, will they understand? Do you guys know that bears actually appreciate the view of things? They'll actually just go out and sit and look at stuff. Fun fact. Okay, will this get me out of this hellhole? Okay, no. I'm gonna pause it. There's really nothing here that I could do. Hey. Okay. Will this take me to a new place? I've been looking around for 10 minutes. Oh, great. We're back here. Okay. I'm just gonna... Pause it while I um navigate through this. I sure do love myself a big old elephant made of snow. You don't these look like those things out there, but without anything, like their soul has been sucked out. Isn't that kind of dark and depressing? Kind of scary, don't you think? Alright. Hello, people. Let's go look under here. Where's this gonna lead me? Back down here. Okay. Hello, all you people. Hello, all you people. Won't you listen to me? Hello. Somebody. Thought it'd be funny to plant a cactus underneath the floorboards. Came back to work and well, what do you know cactus through the roof is it you who planted the cactus oh it's like a maze oh. Oh. I like mazes oh somebody thinks they're funny you're getting fired oh this guy's working his butt off look at him Oh, he's even got food. What kind of food? That looks familiar. See how everything is more light on this side and has plants everywhere and everyone's working a little bit harder? Except this guy. He's just not happy with what he has, but people are working harder. This guy's just... <laughs> okay, that's actually kind of funny. <laughs> that, that crack is from this guy hitting his head it's just everything is paused we're like some kind of really fast being that's my theory we're just so fast that everything is just kind of stopped in time and we're just walking through this area and all they're gonna see on these cameras is just me going really fast See y'all. Oh, look at this little guy. He's just chilling out. Look at him. What a... This man is a businessman. Oh, this guy's just taking a bath in the... Pink sauce. Pretty cool. He must like TikTok. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, he he's the big boss. Oh, so is he. Look at these dinosaurs. They look like they're going, yeah. Reminds me of the little dinosaur people from that one. The last game I played, almost. I feel like I should have looked at that one area more. Because now I'm so curious. Look at these guys. Oh my god, what the hell is going on here? Yeah, I don't like that. Y'all need to- oh. I thought they are just jumping around, but... Uh, some of them like to work in different areas. It's just how it is. This guy's got a cozy little corner here. Oh, what's- what the hell is up with this guy? Oh. Sorry. Uh-oh, somebody's gonna get in trouble.
they, this is how they learn how to do this. Or else, they're being judged. They're judging this one little man. Look, there's even a camera pointed at him, this poor guy. There's so many things going through all these people's heads. None. Good. This is where they get buried, is their graves. That, that's their uh, names being written down. Me, 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 me. Oh my gosh, it might actually be their graves. They just get buried in these things? That's awful. It is their graves. Oh my god, I was right. That's awful. <laughs> this is their home. This is where they live. I wonder if these people know about the upstairs. They probably don't. I mean, look at this. Wait, I have a theory. What if literally all their their only job is is they reproduce so fast that their only job in life is literally just to write down the names of dead their fallen brethren. See, that's what they're all doing. They're writing down like each other's names and things that they said and they're just stuck in this loop that they can't get out of because they keep dying. So they're all stuck here, and instead of building like any type of other grave, they just bury them in the cabinets. That's my theory. This guy's just chilling out though, he doesn't have a damn care in the world. This guy's having a mental breakdown, probably because he wrote down like a thousand of dead other ones, and this guy's like, what? What's your issue? Working hard, I see. But the question is, who built this environment around them? It's up here. Oh, upstairs. I think we looked everywhere th there, then. What's in here? Is this where I came in at? I think so. Oh, well, there's something up there. Hold up. I don't know what that is. Can I get up there though? Wait, hold up. No way. Am I actually allowed to parkour up there? Look at it. Oh, it's the cactus. <laughs> am I am I like allowed to just do that? I feel like there's really nothing up there though. This guy's working hard. What if they're writing down their own details? Oh my, this actually makes sense. They're just like being reincarnated into plants. I don't know. But we've been down here, so I'm gonna head back up. I got distracted. What if we just go out into the void? Am I free of this? No. Oh. Oh, okay. It just puts me in there. Here. <laughs> Here. This is really cool. Somebody's deciding to paint it different. Those little plants look familiar. Look at the water. I wonder if that's like one of those cactus things. And I'm wondering how things are even growing in this place. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh 
okay, I got out. Yeah, I think we've seen most of this, so I'm gonna restart level. Y'all, I think that's it for this one. If you guys want to look at this game and try to find more, please do. I'm sorry if I missed anything. Hope you guys enjoyed, though. This game was very peaceful and very interesting. I liked it like Concrete Simulator. The, the concrete Mixer Simulator, my bad. And I feel like these games have a very interesting message. I feel like the games kind of talk about life, death, and then holding on to life, and then religion, and then uh, people who don't even have time to think about that kind of stuff. I feel like, if that makes sense, I feel like that's the meaning of these games. If that makes any kind of sense, like, you live and then you die, you can try to hold on to your life, you can not care about your life, you can be afraid of death, you can have a religion, you can have all that, but in the end, we still die and then life just kind of continues, you know? It's just, it's just life, and I feel like that's kind of what these games are. I might be looking into it a bit too much, but... I mean, look down in those offices, you know, think about that. Like, the way that some of them were working, some of them were exhausted, some of them were actually just having fun because they didn't want to work until they probably died. Some people don't got time to think about that kind of stuff. And... Who are we to judge? People for not wanting to live like everybody else and be different. And I feel like the last game had a lot of that as well because there's that one farm area that kind of reminded me of it uh, where the guy had like the dinosaur family pet things that were really interesting. And I feel like that farmer didn't really get to think about religion and I think that his like only view on life was just what he did. I don't think that he really thought about anything else. I think it was just farming those plants and then the dinosaur people. And if you take this out of context, none of this would make sense. <laughs> you know what I mean? But if you see the last game, maybe you'll understand. I don't know. I think I might just be a little crazy too. But uh, in my opinion, I really, I think we actually did explore all the offices, but my opinion i really like these games i don't know if that's the meaning or if we're just supposed to make a meaning out of it but that's how i see it i think it's just life and death and then how some of us try to think of religions and whatnot and uh yeah i don't know really interesting that's just my take on it but uh yeah hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you all in the next one peace out be safe and goodbye thank you guys so much for making it through this video